Right, so in this video we're going to be talking about these channels that say, oh, how to get 10 subscribers a day, how to get more watch time or whatever. And uh, yeah, in this video we're going to be talking about what I think about them. In this one video we're going to be mainly talking about this Jay Cartier guy. So we look at this Jay Cartier guy, This he's got 37,000 subscribers, 146. But when you actually look at his channel views then you'll see that it's a very big gap to what he should be getting and um not to like flex my ego or anything like that but um i get more views than him on his most recent videos and the fact that this guy has like got like what 500 times more subscribers than me is absolutely ridiculous and you see the problems i have with these channels is that they literally repeat themselves forever. They repeat themselves for ages. And the fact these channels make points like, oh yeah, you need to have good logos, you need to have good banners because that's your first impressions. No, people don't search up your name. They find it in your recommended section. It's so fake. It's not even true at all. And the fact that this guy is telling you how to grow a YouTube channel, which, um, and in my opinion, I don't think he's grown a YouTube channel right. Because if you're getting that many views compared to your subscribers, you do realise that's really bad. Like, that is not good at all. That is not how you grow a YouTube channel. Subscribers don't help you. Um, I don't know what you did to get that many subscribers and then not even get frequent ones. Get, like five likes a video and barely any views it's ridiculous now if you look at some of his thumbnails he uses literally the exact same pose however many times and the fact on one of your tip videos you said oh you need to make gum thumbnails which is a good point but if you don't do that yourself because you're reusing a pose and to be fair it's quite a good pose but it's been used so many times that it doesn't stand out in someone's recommended because that's how you usually find a channel and if you want to say to me oh yeah but that's just your opinion that it's a bad thumbnail if you look at his views like i've said before it can't be a good thumbnail because if it was an actual good thumbnail people would click on it and the fact that they didn't proves that they didn't like the thumbnail it's just compulsory it's democracy nobody liked the thumbnail there are very few people that actually like the thumbnail so this is a message from a small youtuber that gets more views than you not flexing or anything like that but just the way you grew your channel, it clearly didn't work out right. And uh, just tell me, if you're watching this video, tell me what way you growed your channel. Because you clearly don't get the views that you're supposed to get for your subscriber amount. And anyone in the comments would agree with me on that. But yeah, I think that's all for today's video. I will catch you guys in the next one.